Introducing a revolutionary new placing machine that makes an overwhelming contribution to the optimization of a placing line by combining the functionality of both chip mounters and multi-purpose mounters. The XPF is a high-speed multi-purpose placing machine that realizes borderless optimization by eliminating the distinctions between chip mounters and multi-purpose mounters, thus creating the optimum operating conditions for placing line. Now let's take a look at some of the advanced functions that the XPF has to offer. The dynamic head exchange function is a world's first, offered only by the XPF. The throughput of a line is improved dramatically thanks to the ability to exchange the head while the machine is operating. The XPF has a variety of auto tools which are used as the head, such as the single nozzle, which offers the versatility of a multi-purpose mounter, the revolver which functions as a chip shooter, and the glue auto tool. Changeover for each of these auto tools is specified in the production program. And the changeover is performed at extremely high speed during automatic operation. The XPF utilizes a dual vacuum head, not only for parts pickup, but also to hold auto tools such as the single nozzle, revolver, and glue auto tool. Thanks to the ingeniously simple vacuum mechanism used to hold auto tools, it is possible to automatically change the head type at high speed and with high accuracy, even during production. When the revolver auto tool is used as the head, the XPF functions as a high speed chip shooter. When the head type is changed to a single nozzle or mechanical chuck, the XPF possesses all the versatility of a multi-purpose mounter. Let's take a look at the movement of this revolver auto tool that was filmed using high-speed photography. When the revolver is lowered and raised, the selected nozzle moves at twice the stroke of the revolver to perform parts pickup. As can be seen, if half of the nozzles of another company's head are exchanged, the machine no longer operates at the speed expected of a chip shooter, and also becomes slow and inefficient when compared to the multi-purpose mounters. Furthermore, the head is unable to pick up large parts. This kind of head is halfway solution to the combination of chip shooter and multi-purpose functionality. On the other hand, the XPF utilizes dynamic head exchange using the revolver and single nozzle auto tools to realize 100% functionality as either a chip shooter or a multi-purpose mounter. There is absolutely no drop in efficiency due to nozzle allocation. It is no exaggeration to say that the XPF is the ultimate versatile machine thanks to the dynamic head exchange function which realizes borderless optimization. Next, we'd like to introduce the standard specifications of the XPF. The XPF is capable of handling a wide range of parts from extremely small chip parts like 0402 millimeter parts to parts as large as 45 by 150 millimeters. When placing chip parts, the XPF operates at the same speed as a chip shooter. In other words, the XPF functions as both a chip shooter and a multi-purpose mounter. To continue, we'd like to discuss the two types of XPF bases. There are two types of XPF bases. The XPF-L, to which devices can be attached on both sides. And the XPF-S, which has devices only at the front of the machine. Both of these base machines offer identical production capabilities, such as a wide range of part support and high throughput. And both of these base machines are capable of adapting to any production conditions to offer the highest level of performance.
Furthermore, there are three types of XPFLs. The dual side clamp offers the ability to attach feeder pellets on both sides. For the fixing clamp, the front side uses a fixed device, so feeder pellets can only be loaded at the back of the machine. Finally, the dual side fixed uses fixed devices at both the front and back sides of the machine. For XPFLs with a clamp at the back side, it is possible to attach a bore tray unit A, otherwise known as a BTUA, or a multi tray unit A, otherwise known as a MTUA. For the XPFS, feeders can be attached only at the front of the machine. However, in addition to having a device at one side of the machine, up to four types of tray parts can be loaded inside the machine. This gives the XPFS an extremely high level performance while maintaining a reasonable cost. Now we'd like to explain how a line composed of XPFs realizes borderless optimization. Let's compare the operation of an XPF line with a conventional line. Focus your attention on the multi-purpose melter, which comprises the last stage in the conventional line. The conventional line is limited by the capabilities of the multi-purpose melter. As a result, a heavy burden is placed on the chip shooter machines earlier in the line, and the production time for the entire line increases. On the other hand, in an XPF line, all three machines can perform production as a chip shooter. This reduces the number of placements performed by the machines earlier in the line and a faster production time is achieved. As you can see from this example, the XPF realizes borderless optimization by eliminating the border between multi-purpose mounters and chip shooters. Next, let's examine how the line configuration of the XPF adapts according to the needs of the panel being produced. For the line being shown, all four XPF machines are operating as chip shooters. This maintains a high level of efficiency when producing panels with many placements, or when mass producing panels. The next panel being produced requires 30 medium sized parts and 30 large sized parts to be produced. In this case, the machines operate as chip shooters until the middle sequence of the third machine, and then the remaining machines operate as multi-purpose mounters. Finally, let's take a look at a line that includes a glue auto tool. Thanks to the dynamic head exchange function of the XPF, BGA parts can be placed first on the panel, making it possible to achieve an extremely high level of placement quality. In this process, the first XPF performs inspection to ensure that no foreign objects exist on top of the panel. Then safe placement of BGAs is ensured by placing BGAs immediately in the first sequence. Glue is dispensed at the next step, then chips are placed at the speed of a chip shooter in the remaining processes. As you can see, there is no drop in efficiency as a result of the glue auto tool being added to the line. Both high efficiency and high quality are realized. The XPF is truly an all-in-one placing machine, capable of handling any type of production within one machine. There is no longer any need to worry about allocating chip shooters and multi-purpose mounters in a line. The XPF offers two types of tray units. A multi-tray unit which combines the use of feeders and trays and a board tray unit which supports up to five types of tray parts. The BTUA is used by simply stacking trays on top of the board. Stacking of trays and automatic removal of trays is also possible when using the BTUA. Furthermore, changeover is made extremely efficient by removing and inserting boards which are already loaded with trays. Trays are easily set on top of the board by aligning them with the L-shaped guides and securing them with magnets. A maximum of five different tray types can be set on the board, and trays at each position can be stacked to a maximum of 32 millimeters. Approximately 25 trays can be set on the board at one time. 
This kind of capacity rivals that of small tray magazines. Furthermore, unlike magazine-type tray units, it is not necessary to advance and retract trays when performing tray selection at a BTUA. The reduction in the time required for tray selection results in a faster production tack time. Also, operators can easily see not only how many trays are left, but also how many parts are left in the top tray. The XPF uses Fuji Intelligent Feeders. Fuji Intelligent Feeders have already been used for over two years with Fuji's Next and have gained a high reputation among users. Each intelligent feeder has a unique ID number that is automatically recognized when the feeder is set in a slot, making it possible to acquire data such as verification results and traceability. Furthermore, non-stop parts supply is possible by using the dynamic alternate feeder function. You have just witnessed the revolutionary features of the XPF, a placing machine that makes borderless optimization possible. Allow me to reiterate the three main features of the XPF that cannot be found in any other placing machine. The XPF can function as both a chip shooter and a multi-purpose mounter, which makes it possible to produce a complete panel at one machine. Also, thanks to the realization of borderless optimization, fewer machines are needed for production. Furthermore, thanks to the use of the intelligent feeders, feeders required for the next production program can be set while the machine is operating, achieving high efficiency, high quality production. Additionally, the XPF uses customer acclaim features from other Fuji machines, such as the dual vacuum head and Fuji's unique on-the-fly vision processing. Plus, the release of even more unique and immediately useful functions for the XPF is scheduled for the future. Expect even more from future versions of the XPF. The XPF is an all-in-one machine that eliminates the borders between chip shooters and multi-purpose mounters. Imagine what you could do using the XPF.